All right, hello everyone, and welcome back to the Bushy Tail Tribe here in Niche, a genetic survival game. Uh, I just flipped the turn here, and we have a carnivore showing up. So we're gonna have to deal with him. Who's got our best attack? Uh, looks like yours. Is two. Two. Nope, still same one. Come on, let me click on you. Um, yeah, yours is also two. Okay, I guess the faster way to do this would just be to go like this. So, oh no, I can't see it here. That's right. Never mind. I wish you could see um, the stats here as well, um, but that's fine. Um, so I think I'll have you attack. How much do you have left? Eh, still a bit. You can attack three times, and can she could get over there. Yes, you can. You should be able to finish him off then. Yes, and then we can collect that food next turn. It'll be really nice to get all that actually. Um, Rose is getting close to growing up, still a little ways off, but I think while she's here we'll have her just sort of reveal some more of the surrounding area. And then we can go over to the uh, mother-son duo over here who are collecting food for the tribe. You can actually probably have you come right here, collect that, and then do that, and then you can collect that and start to move over in this direction. Why can't you go? Are you blind? What are your eyes like? Oh, you are blind. I did not notice that. That's an issue. So Rico is blind. Blind eyes inactive as well. Okay, you have the inactive blind eyes, that's why. I should have looked at that before I bred um, those two. What do you have? Do you have inactive blind eyes? You do. Normalize. What about you? Normalize and normalize. Okay, so it should be okay to breed those two. We shouldn't get the blind eyes. Um, yeah, it should be okay. So, but I'm glad I figured that out now rather than deciding to breed um, Rico, which I probably won't do that now because um, she is blind. So, wouldn't it be the uh, the best choice? Um, yeah, no more moves. So we're gonna go and pass the turn here. So, I guess I said I said mother and son earlier. I meant mother and daughter. I forgot this one. I forgot that Rico was a female. So, um, I'm gonna have to have you sort of lead the way here. Otherwise, she's not gonna be able to get anywhere. Good, you can dig there, get a little bit of food anyways. Uh, food's not looking great, but ooh, we can actually sneak up on this guy. Yes. Okay, we can gather that turn food next turn. And uh, so I'll have you, um, actually I think I'll have Ivory collect that. Reveal that, and then come all the way back here. Okay, which of you two is the best at collecting? One and one. So you both stink. <laughs> Alright, come there and collect what you can. And then I want you to just um, reveal that. And probably that as well. Nope, I wanted to. I didn't want to move you, I wanted to reveal that, but oh well. Uh, so let's go ahead and flip another turn. Okay, that grass just grew back. Um, let's have you gather that. Reveal that area there, and then that there. Uh, you still have another turn before you grow up. So just collect some food. We 
which is looking a lot better now that we got the meat from that carnivore. Okay, you. Um, reveal the grass you're on, then I want you to come back here, actually, and reveal this area. Oh, we got another... Is that the same dude? I think that's the same guy we saw before. Yeah, it is. So, again, we can let him go about his business. And let's continue to move these two over here. Oh, she can actually... So you come up here. Can you reach that? No, but you can reach that next turn. Get that clan. Give us some extra food. Um, yeah, then let's pass the turn so that... Uh, here we go. Rose is now an adult. Um, so I don't think we should probably just not waste any time at all in having her and Ivory breed. Um, collect a little bit of food and then get your butt in the nest where honestly you're probably going to spend a lot of time there. We got to get our numbers up. Especially with some of uh, apparently there was something there to kill. I didn't even see what it was. It looks like it was, like it was probably a mole. Um, okay. Several of these are getting a little bit older, so we're going to want to do some breeding to replenish our numbers. Okay, so you collect... Is that shell still there? Yes, it is. Go ahead and collect that, and then I want you to come here and reveal some of the area around. I want you to do the same. Can you? Oh, you can't because you are blind. You're not going to be very useful to us, I don't think. i got to be honest. Um, but that's fine. Let's just move on and see what... Oh, another albino baby. Okay. And please don't have blind eyes. That would be um, very bad. Oh, good. Normalize and inactive normalize. So that is perfect. You got the runner legs and a digging paw. Normal body, big nose, medium ears. You have inactive melanism. So that's yeah, that's that's pretty good actually. I am happy with that for the first um, offspring. And I'm going to have Rose come right here. Can you build a nest there? doesn't seem like you can and I'm not sure why. Is it too close maybe? Oh she has to be pregnant first. Okay so um, go ahead and do that and then we'll go back to her. Have her build a nest there. Um, you can basically just stay there. Can you at least collect berries? Okay. So, if nothing else, we can have um, Rico collect berries, if, and that's something she can do at least. I want you to reveal as much of this area. Can you? Okay, you can reveal that. Oh, another berry bush right there. I should be using my scent more. There's a lot of moles around here. That's good. Okay, there's some food here, so you can go ahead and dig that up. And then I want you over here. Oh, apparently that didn't do anything. I was going to have you hit the tree to um, get some of those nuts to fall down, but I guess there was already enough on the ground or something. Okay. No more moves, right? Yeah. You did the Oh, she is. You do have the stinky tail as well. That's good. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and flip another turn here, guys. Another albino baby. Wow. Okay, so we're going to have an entire albino tribe here. Um, you uh, actually look pretty much identical as far as I can tell. Number of fingers, digging paw, normal body. Yeah, still have the good eyes as well. So, another one I'm very happy with. We're going to move out there. Um, actually, I probably did that a little bit 
backwards. But that's fine. And then you can come there and you can basically just sort of review a little bit more area. And I'll have these two. I want you to do that and that and then collect what food you can. Which isn't a ton, but it's better than nothing. Okay, you can dig there, get a little food, crack that open. You're almost at the end of your lifespan though. Which is unfortunate. You, where is Cosmo? He's gotta be even closer. Let's see how many days does he have left? One day, so I think, does that mean this is his last day or he's gonna die the next day? I don't remember. Uh, but he might die this day. Um, sounded a little bit morbid. He will die this day. No, but he might uh, pass away at the end of this turn here, which is unfortunate. Um, but let's just see. Yeah, he did. Okay. Uh, that's a carnivore. Gonna have to deal with that. Who's probably our best? Uh, nobody can really even get over there. Can you get close enough to... I don't think you can. Um, this is a problem. I don't like this at all. Um, let's see. Have you... Uh, what do you got left? Okay. The only good thing is he's probably just going to attack Rico, which sounds horrible, but at the end of the day, she might be the most um, expendable. Or one of the most expendable, anyways. Um, you can't attack or anything, so I'll just have you gather berries there. Let's have you get as much food as you can. And... Can I get anyone else over there? I don't know if I should even try to get anyone else over there to fight that. Oh, I didn't even look at the baby. What am I doing? Okay, this one is a little bit different. But still looks pretty good. We have... Nimble fingers, runner leg, which is even better. The eyes are good, tail is good, and it's got ram horns. That's really good as well. It does have hemophilia, but they changed the way this works. I don't know. I think you have to have you used to have to have double for that to uh, come into play. I believe. I'm not sure if it's still like that. Um, do we have anyone else to move? You can go ahead and come there. I'm going to move you here because I want to stay as far away from that as possible. And you can come down there. Alright, you. There. And then there. Okay. Can you. Do any digging or anything? No, okay. Um, I guess I could move him to... No, I can't even get over there to attack if I wanted to. So, let's just pass the turn. Let's see how much damage she's going to take. That's two. Okay, that's not terrible. How much does this thing have left? It's almost dead. I bet I could actually... I don't know, I can't get close enough you can attack oh you still have moves left can you attack I don't think you can I don't think you'd be able to get close enough either so just just stand there and gather food I guess and you might be able to. Yes, finish him off. Good. Okay, let's look at this new baby real quick. Um, let's see. This is Nuvanu, who has. It does have the cracker jaw, which I like. I know a lot of people don't seem to like that. That's what I've heard, but I like the look of it, and I like its effect. 
Um, normalized, but does have an active blind eyes, which is not great. Normal body. Everything else looks pretty good. Does have inactive albinism. Are all these getting the hemophilia? It seems that is the case. Um, I'm hoping that isn't something that's going to become a big problem going forward. Um, but you guys can let me know about that. Okay, I want to get you out of the nest. And you down there. Okay, not gonna be able to get back to the nest in time, unfortunately. How is food looking? It seems like food. Okay, so my berry bush there. That's that's good. Anyone able to collect that food? Doesn't look like anyone can get there in time. Um, I don't want to mess with you. You can just do your thing. Uh, we need someone to be able to collect these nuts. That's basically gonna be your job when you're old enough. I'm going to do one more turn here, guys. Okay, collect all that. You collect that. And sort of expand our territory here. Is there any... I just need to collect there. This grass that grows back is really annoying. But you can dig there. So a little bit of food. Collect what you can. You collect as much as you can. And you're not going to be able to do a whole lot. What's your cracking? Just one. I don't know if that's enough to crack these. Oh, it is. Good. Uh, go to the nest here. And I'll just put Rose back in the nest. And in fact, we'll put her in this nest because why not? And I think that's all of our moves for the turn. So, guys, I think I'm going to end it here. Um, sort of probably the most interesting um, of episodes. Mostly it was just a lot of breeding. Um, but we are getting that population back up. And the food is looking really nice as well. Uh, this island isn't too hard. From my understanding, this is the larger easy island, um, which, as I'm certainly not like an expert on everything in this game, I think this is probably right um, um, at my level, I guess. <laughs> this is probably the right place for me to be. Um, eventually, it would be cool to move this tribe to a more difficult island, but I don't know um, if I will be continuing this for, or you know, this particular tribe for that long. Plus, I don't know when if there's a new update, it might sort of wipe this um, save, make it no longer um, uh, usable, but we'll sort of see how that is. I don't know when there's going to be another update, at least another major update, so that might not be even something we need to worry about. You had the cracker jar. I guess I could have put you up there to gather that. You still have some life left. You can have you do that in the next one. Uh, but anyway, guys, we're going to end this right here, so thanks for watching, and I will see you all in the next one.